Yes YouTube, I'm back to another video and thanks for joining me. So in today's video we're going to be finally unboxing the ADA 30C as well as the filtration, the ADA lighting. So that's something interesting and make sure you stay tuned. Without further ado, let's get on with today's video. And welcome back. So. For those who've been following the channel for a while, you know I bought a ADA 30 Cube Aquarium a couple of months ago. Um, I've had trouble acquiring a stand. We do have a stand for it now. So I'm going to unbox this. We've got the lighting, we've got the tank, we've got the filtration. So we will be looking to set this up in the next couple of weeks and fully scape it out to obviously add fish. So if you don't want to miss out on any of that, then make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. But I think that's enough of me talking rubbish. Let's open this box. Okay, so it's been pretty difficult not opening this up, and it's a bit like having a Christmas present you can't open. So I'm really glad we've got a stand now so we can finally check out these products. So let's have a quick look. Okay, so we've got a little packaging. It's always great. Okay, so we have got the lighting. Woo I'll show you these a little bit better in a sec. Wrapping. And more. Okay, so we've got the filter, which it should be the Awade Filter Smart Thermo 100 which it is, and we'll take a look at that in a second. And finally, the tank itself. Right, let's clear away this rubbish first. Okay, so the exciting bit, the beautiful low iron glass that is ADA. Woo! Looking snazzy. Okay, so let's get this open. So this is the second ADA tank I've ordered. So this one, obviously we've got the ADA 45P. We will shortly be looking into getting maybe three to four ADA 60Ps. Ooh, it looks lovely. Okay, so in the bag, we've got a little booklet. And also there's some clips. Now these clips are for if you want to add a lid onto this, it holds the lid in place, but we probably will need those in the future if it's going to be a beat escape. But I want to pick this up with some towels, just don't want to get it all fingerprinty. Alright, let's get these out of the way. And there we go. Ooh, very nice. Let's get it turned around the right way, shall we? Okay, amazing. Okay, so we're gonna just move this for time being, just while we open the light in. Give ourselves a bit of room.
Right, okay, time to open the Aqua Sky. So this is the ADA Aqua Sky 301G, I believe. So it's obviously similar to the twin style lighting, but obviously made by ADA. Very nice packaging, as you come to expect with sort of more of a premium brand. Okay, so the most important thing, let's take it out and have a look. There we go. Okay, so we've just got a little note just specifying what it's made out of and the features. Also got some instruction manuals. Okay, so let's take a look at the actual light. Ooh, very nice. Okay. And we just then got the power cord. Also got a little buckler. Okay, and just the power cord in there which we're going to need a plug for actually, which I've got a spare, so that's fine. Okay, so this one, and I think a lot of them come with European plugs, so we just need to add a British plug on, obviously depending on where you are, yours is perhaps going to be different, but as you can see, European plug there. So we'll just add that on now, and then we'll add it onto the tank just to see what sort of look it gives, and we'll go from there. So we've got it set up. I always like setting these tanks up, even if they're empty, adding the lights on, just adds a bit more into the room. But we will be escaping this very soon. And like I mentioned, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on that. So the specs on this tank, so this is an ADA 30C aquarium. So C standing for cube. Now it's 30 centimeters by 30 centimeters by 30 centimeters. And that works out roughly about seven, 7.1 or two gallon US gallons. And then I think it's 27 liters. Um, the glass thickness on this is low iron glass and it's five millimeter glass. So it obviously hence why you can see a lot of the, it looks a lot clearer, perhaps a lot bluer than the greeny tinged regular glass. Now the plan is to scape this for my beta fish Steve and then obviously we'll do a completely new scape on it, probably get some new materials in and I'm still trying to contemplate on what sort of scape this is going to be. But I want to try and make it a dark sort of background tank. I want to try and get some, primarily focus on the green plants just because the ADA Aqua Sky actually shows off the greens a lot better. It isn't an RGB light, but obviously it is great for growing plants. So we're going to add CO2 onto this. We've already ordered the CO2 system just because it's going to be a high light system. So you're going to need CO2. But I think I'm going to go with a carpeted uh, bottom completely. I don't know whether we're going to go with sand in this one, but I'll probably change my mind over time. So we'll go, we'll see. Now I'll leave links down in the descriptions for any of these items if you want to go and buy something similar yourself or just go and look into them, so make sure you check that out. So plenty of things coming up on the channel very soon, so we've got the ball pipe and vivarium to make a start on, as well as the ball pipe himself is coming in December, still waiting on a date for that. We're also going to be scaping out this tank as well, we've just finished Birds by Active Builds, so if you haven't seen that yet, go and check out the playlist, um, definitely worth checking out. But I think I've chatted rubbish for long enough for this video. So if you can do me a massive favour and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out any future videos. As well, if you're regular viewers, can drop me that thumbs up and leave me a comment to show YouTube you're enjoying this sort of content and allows me to make more videos like these. But don't miss out. Thanks for checking out today's video and I'll see you in the next one.